Hello Capricorn, how are you? Welcome to my channel Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Capricorn, this is your reading for the month of Jan and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Capricorn, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the video. There is an extended reading for this one. The link for the same is in description box and comment section. In the extended, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and this person. Alright, so coming back to this reading on YouTube, Capricorn, what I'm going to do is I'll shuffle the cards, I'll lay them down and then we'll discuss what is your energy what is the energy of the person you are thinking about, you are dealing with, or you will be dealing with, right? Let's get started now. Alright, so Capricorn, what is your energy for the month of Jan, or for the last 15 days of Jan, more specifically? Seven of Wands, we have Judgment. Hermit, energy of your person, three of pentacles, eight of swords, and the sun, okay? The zodiac signs which are going to be important for you for the last 15 days of Jan are Virgo, Sagittarius, Leo, I'm also hearing Capricorn, another Capricorn for some of you. This is your spread. All right. So Capricorn, what is your energy for the last 15 days of Jan? Hermit, then we have judgment and we have seven of wands you will choose to you will choose to stay away from any kind of uh, disputes fights uh, disagreements okay and somehow you will feel that if at all there are any kind of disputes or dis disagreements or uh, verbal fights happening with anyone you'll notice that there are there are few people who are actually dragging you to be a part of these fights who are actually dragging you uh, into such kind of aggressive conversations who are dragging you to participate in the disputes and disagreements and at the end you are you sort of lead the fight and you finish it up and you notice that you consume a lot of energy in doing that okay and it's not that you're you are interested in getting into disputes or getting into verbal fights with anyone no you you are you are someone who is fair and just you cannot stand injustice okay so maybe if an if you find yourself getting into any kind of fights or disputes that is because you cannot stand injustice okay and uh, However, I also see that there are some energies around you who like to trigger you, who like to create this unrest, who like to push you to participate uh, in such kind of disputes. And once you get involved, they they step back and they, they become the spectator uh, of this disagreement or dispute. And you are the one who, who is required to finish this and you finish it off without any kind of support. And you have, you have sort of... Uh, you never received any kind of support from anyone when you needed it okay and whereas you always stood up for other people you always were there for other people and and it's not just confined to fights or disagreements even in other situations when you needed someone there was nobody to help you out there was nobody there to be with you but when others others needed you 
you were always there you were always there for them so you have sort of uh, you were able to connect the dots you were able to see the patterns you were able to observe certain things and the next 15 days i feel like you will sort of distance yourself from all the drama from all the fights from all such situations where you are feeling like oh, things are happening which are absolutely unnecessary okay there is no need for me to get involved because nobody is there to support me i fight for justice i cannot stand in justice i fight for what is right but people just end up triggering me and at the end they don't support me right so you <clears throat> will sort of distance yourself from such kind of dramas you will sort of distance yourself from such kind of situations and people as well is what i'm getting you will prefer to remain in solitude you'll prefer isolation you'll prefer uh, disconnecting from the rest of the world some of you may also get out of social media in the next 15 days <clears throat> you would be like i want to do some yoga i want to do some meditation okay you will try to align your mind body and soul in the next 15 days you will do something to align your mind body and soul because you'll realize that the more you are finding yourself into situations where <clears throat> your energy is getting consumed unnecessarily the more sad and disheartened you are becoming the more uh, you know negative feeling feelings are creeping inside you uh, especially because no one is there to help you out when you need it then okay so you are also holding back your energy you are also holding back from situations where people are asking for your help and they are quite used to to asking for your help and you have helped them a lot in the past but you don't want to extend that generosity anymore what you are doing is you are preferring isolation you are preferring staying away from the chaos you are preferring <clears throat> you are preferring some you you want inner peace you don't want to end up hurting yourself unnecessarily you want to stop everything and anything that has actually contributed in your uh, uh you know contri- or increased your pain you don't want to do that you don't want to cause pain to yourself by being there for people all the time okay and especially you fighting your own fights alone <clears throat> you don't want to do that uh as far as your person is concerned we have the sun eight of swords and three of uh, pentacles there is someone who has strong desire to be with you there is someone who has the strong desire to create a partnership with you there is someone who wants a long term situation with you and this person is going to show a lot of excitement around you that you know they may indicate directly as well that they want to be with you <clears throat> but this person likes to convey their messages indirectly more okay they will like to shower a lot of love on you they will like to uh, you know appreciate you gift you they would like to show that soft corner and inclination towards you they will keep on supporting you in almost everything so that will be kind of an hint that they really like you okay uh with eight of swords i feel like you may be in slight dilemma when it comes to this person but with three of pentacles i see eventually this connection is going to happen you may take some time this connection may happen in jan or probably in the later months as well <clears throat> you might exp uh, you might meet this person in jan or maybe in later months as well but i see a connection is definitely happening at least in the first six months for you guys okay all right capricorn i hope this resonates and hit like share and subscribe comment on below the link for the extended is in description box and comment section all right take care and bye bye